Hello and welcome to Team Topics, where you'll learn all you need to know about powers and roots and how easy they actually are. I guess most people watching this video already know that 3 squared or 3 to the power of 2 is equal to 9. This is because the 2 in the expression represents the number of times 3 needs to be multiplied by itself to get the answer. So, 3 times 3 is 9. The 2 in this expression can also be called the power or the index and it is these that I want to talk about in this video. The index can be any number, it doesn't even need to be an integer, but let's keep things simple for now. Some indices have special names. When you multiply any number by itself, mathematicians often say you have squared that number, so 5 squared equals 25. Similarly, 5 cubed or 5 to the power of 3 is 125. Numbers such as 1, 4, 9, 16, 25 and 36 are known as square numbers because they have been calculated by squaring other integers. In this case, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Cube numbers can be worked out in just the same way, except that you need to multiply each integer by itself three times. The first few cube numbers are 1, 8, 27 and 64 and they get big pretty quick. 64 is interesting because it is both a square number, 8 squared, and a cube number, 4 cubes. To find which two identical numbers multiplied together to give a particular answer, you need to find the answer's square root. The square root of 25 is 5 and the square root of 64 is 8. You can write the expression like this, and you can also write it like this, or this. Whichever way you write it, the answer is still 5. Exactly the same is true for cube roots. We write the symbol, cube root, to show the difference with the root sign. The cube root of 64 is equal to 64 to the power of 1 third, which is equal to 4. This is because finding the square root is the opposite of squaring and finding the cube root is opposite to cubing. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video and it helped you in any way, please subscribe so you're notified for any future videos.